Hey, good morning, everyone. It's Kim Crumpus from the Price Action Traders Institute, and it is Tuesday, July 31st, the last day of the month. Today, I wanted to talk about one of the trades that I'm currently in, the dollar yen, and just kind of review how I'm managing this trade and what I'm looking to do with the trade if if prices begin to move again they started to move early on the open and then kind of fizzled out it's around it's actually 7 45 a.m pacific 10 45 a.m eastern so let's go ahead and take a look at the dollar yen right so what you're looking at here is the live chart of the dollar yen and this morning during the planning session we had a range and actually during the planning session there was a break of that range and I had a pending order to buy that break in case it happened while I was doing the live session and in fact it did happen so I was filled at 59 on a break we had a beautiful close outside of the range and now we have prices just going sideways for about the last hour and 15 minutes and that will typically happen especially after you get a beautiful burst like this so right now i have locked in plus 20 pips on this trade so i am locked in just below the 80 level at 111.79 so i've locked in 20 pips i'm currently down this morning on early trades that i took before the new york trade planning session hit and some of them hit losses while I was in the planning session and I'm currently down 71 pips so I'm in a recovery mode trying to recover and chip away at this loss that I'm sitting on and so I'm looking for this trade to possibly bring some offset to that 71 down and really what I'm looking for is I'd like to see price come up into zero zero accelerate into 11220 possibly this morning so 11220 and then I'll assess what the market's doing across the board to decide if I want to try to stay in this trade if it even gets up there but at 11220 that would be a about a 60 pip trade and that would help really take away most of this loss so i'll be back with any updates it's 7:48 now so i'll be back and let you know how this trade's going hey there i'm back with an update it's now 8:45 a.m so it's been about an hour since i started recording this and the only thing differently is i've moved this protective stop now to lock in plus 25 and I've also added a limit way up here at 112.50 in case the market blasts up through 112, 120, and or sorry, 112.20 and all the way up to here. But right now, as you should be able to see, the last hour price has just been going sideways and it has not even hit 112 yet. So all the end crosses are pretty much going sideways have been for the last hour or two in some cases so i'll be back if there's any update but right now i've got 25 pips locked in here just above the 80. all right hey there everyone you can see or should be able to see now that my protective stop was hit and i am out of this trade for plus 25. so that was it this morning again just to review very quickly we had a range on this price action overnight we had the break of the range right here the entry was at 59 and we had nice price action in an upward trend moving to the top that resulted in a clear directional move up and I kept moving my stop up and finally locking in plus 25 which was just hit so that's it for today's trade of the day I hope you enjoyed that and I hope this helps your trading all right thanks everyone for listening